Guys, guys, guys. I got my first owl crate in like two months, so I'm super excited because I was having owl crate withdrawals. But the last two boxes didn't interest me, so this one is themed uh, Make It Out Alive, and I'm so excited because there's two books in here. So let's get started. Get my handy dandy corkscrew knife. Okay. And, and inside of it looks like this. Don't know if the light's giving it too much of a glare, but okay. So we've got our pretty little project card, which to me looks a little bit like the cover of the book that I'm pretty sure is going to be in here, but that I hope has a really cool exclusive cover since they're doing that from now on until the end of 2017. That's freaking awesome. So, okay, so the first thing on top of the box is a bubble wrap bath bomb, which we also knew, and this was from Fizzy Fairy Apothecary, I think. And it looks like this. Um, I'm trying to read the label. Um, it doesn't say what flavor, just faction. Oh, faction! Okay, so this is the Divergent. Faction bath bomb made exclusively for Owl Crate. And so maybe once you use it, you figure out which faction you are. But, okay. Um, and next up is Owl Crate Exclusive Laser Brain Patch Co. Um, and it's got like this design, like houses with an apple. And it's like an iron-on patch. Um, I don't know what this is for though. It kind of... Oh! It's the giver. The apple. The giver. Yes. Okay. So that's neat. Um, don't know when I'm going to use it though. <laughs> this next item. Zombie sleep mask. And you probably maybe know I'm a fan of The Walking Dead. And I've been on The Talking Dead and I won that surfboard that is right there. So... Zombies, fun, but I don't normally use sleep masks, but it might help when I accidentally stay up till 5 a.m. reading, um, and it's light outside, but okay. So, continuing on, we have a bookmark that says, you do not fear, you do not falter, you do not yield, Sarah J. Moss, and then the back side says, remember that you are a wolf and you cannot be caged. That's from A Court of Wings and Ruin, just like a basic bookmark, but not too thrilled with that one. And then we've got ourselves a, it's like a magnet that almost looks like the coaster that we've gotten before. So, fear is only your enemies if you allow it to be. An ember in the ashes, the bata here. But that is a cool, very sturdy magnet. So, my mom's going to hate this being on the fridge, but I'm going to force it to be there. So, yeah, that's fun. Okay, and then... Since we get two books in this box, one with the first is from Of Tomes Publishing, and I've actually been wanting to read this for a while. It is paperback, but it's awesome because this book sounds good and I've wanted it. I was hoping it was this one, but I didn't think it would be since it's been out for a while. It was published in, um, this has some cool drawings in it, by the way. It's got like a little map thing there, and drawings of characters and stuff. That's really, really cool. Um, so this is yeah, New World Rising by Jennifer Wilson. I didn't say that before, sorry. But when was this even published? 2014. So it's been out for three years, but and I haven't gotten to it yet. So this is exciting to have gotten. And then the book of the month is the Sandcastle Empire, which unfortunately I think the cover is still slightly boring. They really did just change the sky from green to white from the original cover. So, I mean, it's slightly better than the original cover because it's a little more colorful if you count white as a color. <laughs> but yeah, I think the cover is still boring, but this book still sounds amazing. And it's gotten amazing reviews so far, so I'm excited to read this book despite how boring it looks. <laughs> they really should have come up with something better, but maybe the cover goes really well with the story for all I know. I mean, they are on like an island 
but yeah. So then we also got the exclusive author letter and signed book plate. And let's see now. We've got our monthly button. There is a little eye like person looking out from behind a tree on the card apparently, since I always take it from the card. Yeah, okay, it's right 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 here. Right there. But and I think they're discontinuing the buttons soon. So yeah, I will create number 28, Make It Out Alive. And I think like in August they're starting with something else. Let's see, so then we got some exclu some stickers that are from the Sandcastle Empire. So it says like when all hope is gone, how do you survive with a canoe? And then like the same with the um the comp like the north, south, east, west directional compass. I don't know if there's actually like a word for that. And then, when all hope is gone, how do you say, oh, that's a little, and then a life jacket, and then a book of matches. So, yeah. I totally forgot to read the project card, so here, I'm going to read it real quick for you now. So it says, channel your inner bravery with the beautiful magnet inspired by an ember in the ashes, created exclusively for you by Little Inkling Designs. And when thinking about survival, fair, I don't know how to pronounce that, I haven't read Akatar. Don't hate me for that, it's on my TBR. Um, from a Court of Thorns and Roses series definitely comes to mind. We hope you love the double-sided bookmark design exclusively by Hey Atlas Creative. And then have fun with the Divergent Inspired Bath Bomb created just for you by Fizzy Fairy Apothecary. Each bath bomb contains a charm which will sort you into one of the different factions. And then who knows, maybe you'll end up being Divergent. Hmm. So you'll need your rest to survive the apocalypse. Use your zombie sleep mask from Archie McPhee when you need to recharge. One of the most beloved dystopian novels of all time is The Giver by Lois Lowry. We created this awesome patch with the Laser Brain Patch Co., which features the red apple that Jonah discovers in the book. Iron it onto your jean jacket for a subtle bookish look. And looking for a heart-thumping, fast-paced story that will keep you on the edge of your seat, New World Rising by Jennifer Wilson is an intense read about a girl named Phoenix trying to survive the ruthless dystopian city she calls home. The highly rated novel is published by our friends at Of Tomes Publishing. And then finally, the book of the month is The Sandcastle Empire. So when a revolutionary group called the Wolf Pack takes over the world, holding both people and resources hostage, the future looks bleak. Luckily, Eden knows how to reach the last bit of neutral land left called Sanctuary Island. She'll do anything to make it there alive, but once Eden and her friends arrive on the shores, nothing is as she expected, and one of her comrades goes missing in the night. Suddenly, the island feels more deadly and dangerous than her brutal world she left behind. And they say the story is gritty and an intense mix of dystopian, environmental, and survival elements weaved throughout it. So, and we got our signed book plate and letter from Kayla, as well as an exclusive sticker sheet. Yes, I showed that to you, too. And so, happy reading. Thanks for being awesome. And then, our next theme is Wanderlust. And they say, in the July box, you'll receive an officially licensed item from Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. Officially licensed. That's awesome. I'm so getting this book box. <laughs> I'm still getting this box because I know exactly what book it is. It has been on my TBR for ages and it's gonna be fun. Um, yeah, and I don't know if I want an exclusive cover for that book though because I love the cover that's already on it, but I guess if all they're doing really is like changing up the colors or like flipping the artwork like they did for Lies and Her Monsters just a little bit, it might not be that bad or it might be even better. But, like, for exclusive covers, I almost want it to be something, like, completely different. But I, I, yeah, I guess they want to stay, like, in the realm of what it already kind of looks like. But, yeah, so this one, they're doing items from, they said Fantastic Beasts on this card. And online, they also said that it would have items from Lord of the Rings and A Darker Shade of Magic. So Fantastic Beasts, Lord of the Rings, and Darker Shade of Magic, this box is going to be awesome! And the book that's in it, oh my god. This box is to die for. Sign up now. Use my code if you want down there. Um, and yeah, because who wants to miss this amazing box that's coming up? Wanderlust themed. Yeah. So thank you for watching YouTube. See you next time. Have fun reading. Bye.